Hello guys, I'm back with another brand new video. My name is Aris and you're watching Possible Now. So guys, as you know, God of War on PC is out and many of the users face uh, some errors or crashes like out of memory or your GPU is not capable to run this game or some other DirectX errors. So in this video, I'm gonna guide you about how to fix all of these crashes or errors so if this video helps you guys like this video share this video and subscribe our channel too for more content and without any waste of time let's start the video so guys first of all you need to turn off some settings just as i do so go to the research bar and type settings and go to the privacy section and disable all of these settings one by one in general turn off all of them down below click on the background apps and turn off all the background apps running in the background then get back and move to the gaming section and turn off xbox game bar section and turn on game mode now close this get back and move to the uh, next part now you need to open task manager and now you uh, Free your CPU space from here and close users app running in the background while play your game. So my CPU space is already free so I don't need this. Now close it. So guys the second step is you need to download the pack link in the description below. I will show you how to download the pack. So open the link in the description. Here it is. It's actually my website. You can see on research more posts if you want down below and click on the load more button here more post appears maybe some video or a post helpful for you so visit this also and two links in the description guys if the first link doesn't work try the another one now open the link here and uh, first you need to subscribe our channel it will be a big help for us and it will also unlock the download button so subscribe our channel press the bell icon too then you need to close this tab get back and move to the download button and simply download the pack from here it takes few seconds so wait for it and if this video helps you guys like this video share this video and subscribe our channel too for more content So guys, as you see, the pack is downloaded. So guys, after download the pack, then you need to extract the pack here and wait for it and then open the pack and now follow my steps carefully. First open DX folder and install DX12 in your PC, accept the agreement, click to next, install the Bing bar, it's optional so it's up to you. Click to next and wait for it. Maybe it takes some time, so don't be panic. And if this video helps you guys, like this video, share this video, and subscribe our channel too for more content. So now it's done. Click to finish, get back, and move to the next folder optimization. And these all are ready files for your PC. So run all of them one by one. CPU optimization. CPU priority class, disable power throttling, game optimization, increase CPU performance, increase system responsiveness, low mid optimization, mid high optimization, or third priority, power optimization, and in the end, priority class. So, guys, now it's done. Get back and move to the next folder GPU priority. Select your GPU if you use AMD, run this rigid file. For Intel users, you can run this rigid file and for NVIDIA users, just run this rigid file. Okay. Now get back and move to the fourth folder, GPU settings and select your GPU. For AMD users, you can uh, see first and apply these settings for your game for best performance. Uh, number second, for Intel users, you can apply these settings and for NVIDIA users, you just run this ready file okay after it's done get back and move to the uh, lesser folder first you need to extract here then you need to install it I already installed this so I don't want to install it again here it is 
so guys first of all maybe uh, it takes 10 seconds to continue in start then go to the main section and mark those settings pro balance enabled and the second one is active power profile set on high performance just mark those settings and after this close lasso get back and move to the uh, next folder mini softwares first open ISLC and open the notepad and read the instruction from here first then install ISLC here it is guys uh, first you need to simply click on the stop button and stop the processing running in the background then I have 8 GB RAM so uh, I'll, I'll be right here half of my RAM memory I will show you on calculator what to do 8136 divided by 2 equal to 4068 so you will you'll be right here 4068 and also mark those settings start ISLC and launch ISLC and wanted time resolution set on 0 0.50 and powering rate is set on 1000 and if you use 2 gb or 4 gb ram set on 2000 or 4000 and after apply all of these settings you just need to click on the start button and apply these settings now close this get back and move to the second part power control and first you need to install this and then open power control Here it is so guys the same step you need to apply here is set on first high performance and make sure click has a make active button click on it and disable all of the settings parking ac dc scaling ac dc and all of these priority set on 100 and down below bits and dynamic boost enabled set on high performance and the number you write here is 300 then click on ok click on apply and it's done now move to the next part quick cpu for your cpu first you need to extract here then you need to install it and then open quick cpu so guys first of all you need to set on high performance on system power plan and click as a set active button click on it and all of these pair of these set on 100 and after this just apply the settings okay close this get ba get back and move to the uh, ram optimization folder for your ram and run both of the reddit file one by one okay now it's all done and now you need to uh, delete some junk files or bad files in your pc so press bin plus r and type percentage stamp percentage temp percentage and click on ok and control a select all and delete all of these files now again press pin plus r and now type prefetch click on ok select all and delete all of these also files uh, these all are junk or bad files so delete all of them and after this guys uh, you need to restart your PC so guys if this video helps you like this video share this video and subscribe our channel too for more content and keep supporting possible now and peace out